There is not enough grog in the world to wipe away my sorrow from the tale I just went through, Tracy. No hurry. Oh my gosh. Oh, what kind of tale are we going to go on to today? Hello, Madame Olive. I think you have a tale for me. Ooh, the wild rose. Oh, thank heavens. I've been beside myself, out here all alone with no one to confide in but that beastly Humphrey. There's nothing I can do, you see. Not really. I'm no pirate. Not like my best friend Rose. She's amazing. Oh, I once Rose. saw her bite a rope clean in half, you know. She's so fierce. Unless she's with George. He's her fiancé now. Olive, I'll be doing my best here to find the one they call Rose. I'm sure she's out there somewhere. All right, let's see what we have here. The Journal of Rose. Two hours later. And the tip of rapier king. All right, I think that's where we gotta go. We gotta find the chest. Mate, I hope I can find Wild Rose. And I hope she's okay. I'm a, I'm a bit of a, a bit of a, a sap for a good love story, and I love, I'd love to be invited to their wedding. So I'm hoping that I can find them. We are well on our way here, mateys. I love a good love story. This is, uh, this is good. Okay, let's see, uh, let's see where it takes us here. Good kind of shenanigans. All right, that fire just sitting there. Go find ourselves. Uh, what do we have here? A disgrace skull for the whale lord. Oh, whale lord. How, how perfect. All right, we'll take this with me here until we find. All right, let's see if it's here. Ooh, there it is. We found it, mates. The first part of our adventure. Let's see what they left in here for us. The one they call Wild Rose. Wow. Take lover's notes. All right. I love the music. Where'd my skull go? All right, we have more clues to follow here. But before before I do, I must must place it here. I'll take that back to the whale lord after all. All right, now that the chest is aboard, I have my skull ready for the sacrifice to the whale lord. Let's read the new pages here. Our memories. We should go back to these places and hide our memento. Okay. We survived our first ambush. Okay. The perfect plan. I'll take her back to the first place we made land together. From here, our adventures begin. One eternity later. I'll take her back to the first place we made land together. It's gotta be Sailor's Bouncy. Alright, let's make our sacrifice to the great and mighty Whale Lord. It's been a long time. Oh, well, Lord, thank you for your blessings upon us here today. I just want to say that you mean the world to me, well, Lord, and I cannot do what I do without you here. And on that note, all hail the well, Lord. All right, the sacrifice has been made. Hopefully the clues will be given. Pretty tall tree there. You <laughs> see that tree? <laughs> I think that's uh, I think that's a part of the clue there. There's a tall tree. Match the picture. I think it does. 
That's got to be it. From the base of the tallest tree, we'll spot the place where our eyes first met. That is, I, I see, I see the spot where they first met. From there, we'll spot a rock peeking down at us. There. Oops. All right. And next to the candle lit barrel, we will be able to see two hanging bottles by the beach. Candle lit barrel. From there, candle lit barrel. Beneath those bottles, we sure to drink for the first time. Now, this is a romantic spot. Well, I got to give you credit here, matey. I like it. All right, let's, uh, let's give it a shot here. Oh, perfect. What do we find here? A music box? All right. Can you play? Can you play the music box? You cannot play the music box. I'll leave that tea there. Someone will need the tea later. It's such a good love story here, mateys. I hope. Uh, I hope they will. I don't know what to bring them to the. I don't know what to bring to the wedding here, though. They're okay, and the wedding's still on. I think I'll bring them a mega keg. It's my uh, favorite gift to give anyone, to be honest. <laughs> Now, I think this is on the back side, because I think right there is the path that goes up. I don't know, I'm pretty sure it's on the other side here. Not, not like I've not been to this island many times before or anything like that. I've turned in the ship. Maybe I turned it too much. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I turned her a little too much there. This is fine. Totally fine. This is normal. This is totally... Oh my gosh. This is fine. This I'm just gonna drop the anchor here. Don't worry. There's only one hole. Yeah, see, I told you everything would be fine. All hell, well on. I think it's like right here in front of. <laughs> oh, I'm getting good at this here, mateys. I'm getting good at this here. All right, let's get this back to the ship. See a brig off in the distance there. All right, madame, I've brought I brought you your items that you've uh, requested here. But first, uh, I'm gonna send you that there. Perfect. All right, I found a box of spices and I found a music box. That looks like the music box Rose spoke of. Aye, it is. And these must be George's secret cooking spices. I'm not as skilled at the right as Madame Olivia, but Rose is counting on me, so this has to work. I'll make it work. Oh my goodness. What have you done? There. This compass will lead the way towards Wild Rose and George, wherever they may be. 
please do whatever it takes to get them home safely so they can finally have their wedding day. Oh, you got it, Olive. I'm gonna go find George and Wild Rose. They're just probably doing what uh, new... New pirates do that are madly in love. You know what I'm saying? They're probably just spending some alone time. We'll go find them, though. Get them to their wedding day. Right, where's this? Where's this blimey thing taking me here? I think it's taking me to Lone Cove. George, Rose, Olive is looking for ya. My name is Captain Hitbo TC, and I'm here to get you both to your wedding day. So I know you're here somewhere. I'm gonna come get ya. All right. There's somewhere over here. Oh, there. Where? Rose? Rose, where are you here? What in the... Rose? Wild Rose, is that you? Oh my gosh, what happened here? Oh my gosh, what has happened here? Where's George? And let me place this over here, Rose. I think they're going to be a little late to their wedding here. I'm going to avenge them for you. It's the uh, last thing I do. I'm going to avenge you. Go find George, maybe he's still alive. Sure, where it's taking me, but let's go find George. Oh, this is terrible. Go find George. There's always you, George. That's why Rose was chasing. That's why Rook was chasing us to take you away from. Me. I was so angry I cut and stabbed and sliced because all I could think of was reaching you. Oh my gosh. What in the world? We're going to go find Rook, that scurvy pirate! Or George. He doesn't even know. George! George, are you here, George? Grey Marrow doesn't give away his secrets easily, you know. Still, it was worth it. What have Finding you done? Silly girl's spirit and watching the light fade. From her eyes. Oh, you're I gonna you die for that, Rook. I was magnificent. Oh, no. Don't suck. You'll see things my way in time. After all, I'm all you've got left. Oh, Rook. We're going to kill Rook. Here we go, mates. Wish me luck. This is for Rose, Rook, Mine. you scurvy pirate. Don't you ever, ever do it again. Give me George. Give him to me. Give him to me, Rook, you murderer. You murderer! George! Oh, I'm going to re reunite you back here with Rose. Olive, I have some terrible news. George and Rose didn't make it. Look what I found here. I found their pendants. Rose. George. 
I know, it's terrible news! Oh, by the heavens, I can hear them crying out from the pendants. I've never seen a curse this powerful before. I, 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 I don't know what to do. Come on, Olive. Rose was always there for you, even if it meant she got hurt so you'd be okay. Well, you're grown up now. Your turn to take the blow. I thank you for all you've done for me. But whatever happens now, you must not interfere. There's one last ritual I can attempt, but it's forbidden. Because... because few can take the pain. But even if I don't survive, Rose, well, she'd do the same for me. Believe in you, Olive. doing olive oh my gosh olive all right i don't think this is what we should do olive oh my gosh mates olive are you sure about this Are you okay here? Did it work? Oh, Olive! You brought them back together, Olive! from Rook's curse. I don't think they'll be returning anytime soon. But they found one another. Thanks to you. They are eternally grateful. Oh. And so am I. But I'll make sure everyone in the Order knows what you did for two lost souls today. If anyone can make it to the shores of gold, it's you. Thanks, Olive. I'll do my best here. I think that was the saddest tale I've ever, ever gone on here. Ready when you are. No problem. Tracy, give give me all that you got. There is not enough grog in the world to wipe away my sorrow from the tale I just went through, Tracy. No hurry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 